much better. No repeal. He failed on that, thank God. And he never even presented a plan to replace it. So F is his grave. Trump promised to build a wall, an impenetrable wall, and have Mexico pay for it. Our border with Mexico spans almost 2,000 miles. Trump built 40 miles of easily climbable wall, and we paid for it. F. He said he would invest $550 billion in infrastructure and create an infrastructure fund. Nope. And nope. F. He relentlessly criticized Obama for playing golf and said, I won't have time to play golf. I'll be in the White House working my ass off. Well, while in office, Donald Trump spent 298 days at the golf course at a cost of $144 million taxpayer dollars. So F you. Trump promised he'd bring back manufacturing. Not much action there, though he did sell a lot of hats and my pillows, so I give him a D plus. Trump said, I will make no cuts to Social Security. He tried to make cuts, but the Senate didn't pass them. And in fairness to him, he did try to take money from old people. So let's give him a C. Trump said many times he'd appoint a special prosecutor to investigate Hillary Clinton, F. He promised to close the parts of the internet where ISIS is. I'll give him some credit for that. He did get kicked off Twitter and Facebook, and he got parlor shut down. So let's give him a B plus just to be nice. And while this wasn't a campaign promise, he said about COVID, we have it totally under control. It's going to disappear one day. It's like a miracle. It will disappear. That was last February. Since then, 400,000 Americans have disappeared. F. Now, he did keep his promises to defund Planned Parenthood and remove the United States from the Paris Climate Accord. So give him an A-hole for that. Oh, and the Space Force. Don't forget he created the Space Force. And hopefully tomorrow at noon, he will board a Space Force craft and rocket to Mars, never to be seen or heard from again. So Trump leaves office with a grade point average of uh, F plus and a string of lies that will never be broken. And also a bunch of questionable pardons. Trump is expected to issue about 100 pardons tonight. And he was reportedly calling people to give them the news, the people he pardoned. He loves us so much. He has a pardon hardened right now. One notable name who's been angling for a pardon is Joe Exotic, the Tiger King. Why he thinks Trump would pardon him, I have no idea, but Team Tiger has spared no expense preparing for his possible release. We've delivered everything that I wanted to do on this project. I am absolutely confident that we are gonna receive the part tomorrow. We've got hair, makeup, clean your wardrobe, Now they get him a mental health expert. When he was in the cage with the tiger, or singing about Carol Baskin killing her husband, then there was no mental care expert to be found. But now, I have to hand it to him though, they really put together an exit fit for a king. They also have a will ready to pick him up from the prison in Fort Worth, Texas, and take him to a secure location. It's just Is it sad that the only thing?